Hi everybody, how's it going? Listen, I thought, just let me adjust this here a bit. We'll do a little video today on something that came up that I thought you might be interested in. And that is the difference between a full handle fishing rod and a split handle fishing rod. Especially for you beginners out there, you might want to know what the difference is. A lot of people don't and they just think it's just another form of handle. Uh, it doesn't make any difference. Well, yeah, it does. And it depends on the style of fishing that you're going to be doing as to whether or not you want to use the full handle or whether you want to use what's known as a split handle. So let's take a look at the first one here. I'm going to talk about the full handle fishing rod, the traditional fishing rod that everyone relates to. Basically, we have a fishing rod where the handle material is wrapped around not attached to, but wrapped around the blank at the butt end of your fishing rod blank. Okay, the material can be either EVA foam or cork or some other material. Some are even using now uh, a, a latex type of material, but uh, it encompasses the, the entire handle area of the butt. Now, where would you use a full handle fishing rod? Well, they're really good for distance casting and using in trolling applications. You will need that extra handle material to assist in a trolling application. That's where you put your fishing rod into a fishing rod holder, either in a kayak or canoe or even a motorboat, and you let your line out and let it drag as the, uh, the vessel moves forward. With distance casting, it allows the angler to use both hands and just kind of give it a little extra oomph to get that line out there. That's the best time to use a full-handled fishing rod. Now, split handle, basically, the material that's in the center of the handle has been effectively removed. What you see there is the blank, and you see some handle material above it, above the open area, and down at the bottom. Now, where would you use this type of fishing rod? Well, pick this rod up and compare it to the full handle. You'll notice that it's lighter. So, with it being lighter, this allows the angler to use it for one hand applications, such as drop shotting, bait skip and lure skipping, um, other finesse applications like jigging, twitching, those things where it's easier to perform those applications with one hand and you don't have the full handle getting in the way of your of your arm here it's much easier you'll notice that the rod is actually lighter when they remove the center, center section of the of the handled material so that's where you would use a split handle application if you're going to be using one hand methods finesse a little bit more finesse fishing you would use a split handle fishing rod. If you're going to use distance casting and a little bit of trolling, then you'd probably look to using a full handle fishing rod. Now these fishing rods come in both casting and spinning. All right, so it doesn't matter what your application is, there's a fishing rod for everything. So I hope that gives you some idea with what the difference is between the split handle and the full handle all right you can use either or there's no rule saying that you can't all right but it just gives you an idea of the applications intended for those designs all right so anyway that's my little video for today hopefully you understand that's so the next time you walk into your outdoor store you're going to know what to look for depending on the application that you're using for your fishing rod all right until the next time this is sharon saying bye bye Oh, <laughs>